All right, we're at it yet again. Another workshop where you will actually build, physically build and design a tiny cabin. This one's going to be near Wilmington, North Carolina, November 22nd and the 23rd through RelaxShacks.com. Many hosts, carpenters, guest speakers, demos, and builders will be present. It's going to be a lot of fun. You will learn a ton. RelaxShacks.com. Also, check out my book, Humble Home, Simple Shacks. That's available on Amazon.com. And a shout to our friends at the Jamaica Cottage Shop. We have a tour of this very cabin coming up soon on this channel. Hey, I'm Derek Diedrichson from RelaxShacks.com. I wanted to give you, oh, the sun's totally blinding me here, an update uh, as we're losing it, too. On the Cub Scout fundraising cabin we're building, the idea is I'm a Cub Scout den leader. I was in the Cub Scouts myself, Boy Scouts, Eagle Scout, whole nine yards. I uh, want to help out the local pack with funds they need for future campouts, activities, uh, the blue and gold dinner, that kind of stuff. So I figured what better way to do that than to educate them on building, recycling, we're salvaging a lot of materials and several other things wrapped up into uh, this whole activity. But in the end run, this cabin will be a fundraiser. We're going to auction it off for funds for the scouts. That's a mouthful, I know. So I wanted to give you an update, show you guys what's going on, and want to give a big shout as I whirl the camera around to, uh, here we go, to Joe and Kristen Everson from TennesseeTinyHomes.com. They have given us a quite sizable donation, as has Big Bill, a.k.a. Overkill Bill Rockhill from Bear Creek Carpentry.com. So as you can see, per tradition with a lot of the stuff I build, Super colorful. Brian Nickel, shout to you. He came over, donated this stuff. It's the old sides of a hot tub, cedar tongue and groove, which I had the scouts paint. They helped me frame some of this as well. They framed the floor. Like I said, a lot of salvage, trying to keep it cheap, trying to uh, teach them or show them that you don't have to throw half this stuff away. There could be uses for it to conserve, to be thrifty, and uh, how to frame, build, and just have fun. Some of the framing here is unconventional because we're working with what we have before the framing police start expressing their discontent online. Uh, you know, some of the header work, we're going to give it later a, uh, I'm just messing around up here to, for height sake, a double top plate, things like that. But the materials dictate the build. We're trying to go with a lot of free, found, and donated stuff. So, you know, like I said, uh, different patchwork here. It's going to be covered over flooring later so you won't see that. Where that spray paint line is, is the rough outline of possibly a tiny bathroom with a composting toilet. I'm not sure, but uh, I might mess with the idea. Probably going to be a bench back here across somewhere. And a loft up above for sleeping. It's tiny though. It's only about six feet and change by six feet and change. Um, just to point this out too, before people are wondering, what the heck's going on there, Deke? These horizontal plates right here, we're going to have more vertical framing. This is all going to be covered in tough techs. Um, actually, I can show you right here. See that stuff? Tough techs. Polycarbonate roofing, the stuff they make bulletproof glass from. That's the periscope. We have a whole other tour of that cabin in the works uh, on my channel. But um, I'm going to have more supports and kind of go with that same array of weird framing here, using up all my scraps on this cabin here. It'll be clear. At night, it will light up. It'll look like a cool lantern. This will be displayed publicly in the center of town if all goes as planned. Uh, over here, give me another window. Big old window in the back there, another window on the side here for ventilation, and when this temporary thing is gone right here, going to be a window dead center right there, much like this cabin hidden back here. I got a lot of crap going on in the backyard. This one here. All right? So that's pretty much the update. Again, we could use donations. It's relaxshacks.com. There's a donate button there. I'm going to keep that open for maybe another week or two or three let's make it two or three because we certainly could use the help and uh not a profound video but just wanted to give you an update thanks for watching please subscribe to our channel as well i'm deke and we'll see you later